Hello guys and welcome back to the Media Nights. My name is Ari. And I'm Denise. And today we're going to be reacting to Castaway. Yes. This movie is a classic. You guys have been asking for it all over the place in our Forrest Gump video. <laughs> and we're super excited for it because if there's anything that Tom Hanks can do is definitely put us in our feels. Probably gonna, just going to make us cry all over again. We got some tissues this time though. Yeah, yeah. We have them ready off yes. camera. <laughs> <laughs> just in case. Just, just in, case. in case. So anyway guys, thank you so much for clicking on the video and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care. See ya. Cast away. Imagine this is the entire film. You're just here staring at a crossroads and FedEx trucks <laughs> you're roaming through the country for two hours. And a half. <laughs> I mean, listen, the way we'd be waiting for our packages from FedEx, that that's a thrill ride all on its own. I was like, whoops, oh, we're, we're so sorry we missed you today. Meanwhile, you've been home and you're just like. <laughs> See, that is right there on the desk. So where's she headed? Oh, she's snowbound, Ramon. Snowbound? Snowbound. Oh, I'm going to have another pickup for you on Thursday. All right. Oh. Thanks, oh, that's sick. That's a great shot. I love that choice. We are a package now. We are a package now. <laughs> Time rules over us without mercy. That's why every FedEx office has a clock. That's how much time we have before this pulsating, accursed, relentless taskmaster tries to put us out of business. <laughs> That motivational speech, Hell man. Hell yeah, I Damn. want a boss like that every morning, you know, let's get it. It feels like a, <laughs> yeah. oh, a battlefield. That deserves something special like hey. a Snickers bar and a CD player. <gasps> oh my God. It is <laughs> another clock, which I started at absolute zero and is now at 87 hours, 22 minutes and 17 seconds. Not bad. To Nikolai in Russia, 87 hours. Wow. 87 hours is a shameful outrage. Oh. <laughs> 87 hours is an eternity. The cosmos was created in less time. I'm dead. <laughs> Nations topple in 87 hours. Fortunes made in squander. He's the one fighting for our packages to get here in time, yes. man. You know, this is this is what we need to strive for. See, if he'd been in charge, my packages wouldn't have gotten lost. 15 minutes. God time. damn. This guy means business. Yeah, man. Get those packages moving. He's passionate about his work. Two lines, one to the airport truck. He's amazing. Oh, what an intro, man. This is great. I gotta go to the dentist this week. I got something in there that's hurting. Uh, I love you. And I'm gonna see you soon, and you know what that means. Bye bye. <laughs> Nikolai, tick tock, tick tock. That means real soon. <laughs> that means real soon. <laughs> Knowing him, that means ASAP. Oh my god. He needs to stay on top of his doctor's appointments. That's what we've understood from Tom Hanks. It's about the trucks. Today's truck was two minutes late. Tomorrow's will be four minutes late, and then six minutes late. Next thing you know, we're the U.S. mail. Oh, <laughs> what a dig at <laughs> USPS. <laughs> oh, he made it in time. He made it in time. <laughs> Dancing to the beat of that printer, baby. Hey, you make it happen. I love Aww, that. That's so, so cute. cute. Also, napping in the sofa has to be one of the most comfortable naps ever. Oh, dude, it's the best. Especially, like, just as you're watching a movie. Man, that table is stacked. <laughs> Can I have some? <laughs> Yeah. Look at those marshmallows. Speaking of marriage, Chuck, how are you going to make an honest woman out of killing? Oh! oh. 14 minutes into the mail, so I will Oh, they're not married yet. <laughs> well, I thought they were. She's <laughs> still recovering from her failed relationship with a parolee. He was a lawyer. Oh! <laughs> Kelly just can't be being with a man who wears a pager. Oh. What are you going to attach you to, Hoss? <laughs> One <laughs> <laughs> of those things that go the vibrating, you know. The hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hit an olive pit? I thought I took all of them out. No, no. Oh, the tooth. I've recently been there, actually. Some tooth pain. That sucks. It's the worst pain ever. Just hits different, you know? Oh. It's this cold. Oh, Wait. No. Oh, wow. Damn, dude, it's Christmas, man. All right, I'm gonna have to switch over the South America thing. If I do that, the third or the fourth, I'm gonna have to head back out again on the 13th. Oh my God, he has a mm. very busy schedule. I will be here New Year's Eve, I promise. He's all over the world. Yeah. Hey! Merry Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, <laughs> that's the perfect gift for this man. Yes, that is perfect. That is so thoughtful. Oh, I took this. This is my favorite picture of you. I'm always going to keep this on Memphis time. That is so sweet. You haven't said anything about your presents. No, is there a problem? I'm sorry. No, I love them. What about the pager? Real leather. Look at the pages have gold on them. Seems like a real nice pager. Sorry about the hand towels. No, no, I love them. You're hard to shop for. Every <laughs> Merry Christmas. Oof. Oh, that's rough on Christmas. We have both had to work during Christmas and I'm sure yeah. a lot of you guys too. It's, it's rough, man. New Year's. Trying to make it for the family and trying to make it for the bills, you know? That's, yeah, it's it's hard, man. It's real tough. You know, that <clears throat> reminds me, I almost forgot. I have one more present for you. Ooh. Oh. Only this isn't uh, an open the car kind of present. Like say hand towels, which were a joke, by the way. <laughs> oh, God. Just Take it and hold on to it. You can open it on New Year's Eve. And I love you. Oh, man. Is it is it what we all think it is? Oh. Yeah, I got to take your shoes off when you're traveling across the pond. Man, those seats are so uncomfortable, man. <laughs> oh it's like they're God. designed to be yeah. uncomfortable. It's like a torture box. It's also rough because you're really tall. <laughs> yeah, my knees are always hitting like the, the seat in front of me. It's yeah, very uncomfortable. Ugh, that turbulence. Mm. Like, I know, like, statistically, it's almost an impossibility for your plane to crash with turbulence, but still kind of gets you. <laughs> Anxious <laughs> the entire way. Yeah, just like... <laughs> We're 200 miles south of the original course. FedEx 88, broadcasting in the blind. How do you read? Broadcasting Damn, dude, in the blind. blind. That's not good. I don't like this one bit. He's letting go of all the time things. Yeah, I know. I don't like this at all. <gasps> oh. oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh man, he has none of his stuff with him. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes, put your seatbelt on, man, and... It's so scary how suddenly they can just lose control. Dude. Oh my god, my palms are sweating. Oh my god, dude. Oh no. What do you choose? The watch is right there. Oh man. Get to your seat. Honestly, I would have probably done the same thing. Oh, oh dude. Oh. oh. Oh, that's the... They're going down. That is terrifying. Oh, water. Oh, my God. Oh. Oof. Oh my god. <gasps> wow. Good thing he has a life vest. I don't think that's a life vest. Wait, what is that? Vest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's like one of those um, lifeboats. Oh, oh it is a lifeboat. Yeah, you're right. Oh, great. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. Uh, you don't have a knife. Where's the Smith's Army knife? Oh, oh okay. nice. Thank okay. God. Man, this took a turn. Dude, what in the hell? Oh, the oh, engine is still shit. running. Uh, oh my. Uh, Man, he's really out of luck. Wow. The scale of a person versus a plane, I, huh? I, oh man. We are so tiny. The waves are going insane too. It's just a really yeah, bad it's storm. A bad storm. 
can we talk about how incredibly this was shot and edited, dude? Yeah, honestly, it's unbelievable. It really gives you that feeling of just despair. Yeah. It's absolutely terrifying. Yeah. Both the plane crash was excellent, was shot yeah. incredibly well, and now this yeah. is like my I'm I'm quieter and my palms are sweating for yeah. a reason. <laughs> dude, just imagine I have being goosebumps, at bro. the mercy of nature in its rawest form, man. That ocean is no joke. What the hell is he gonna do? Wow. <laughs> what a turn. Ah, oh, damn. You gotta be kidding me. Is that a rock? Is that land? Did he reach land? I mean, I hope so. Anything is better than the water at this moment. Yeah. I love how real this is shot. Like the darkness, yeah. the lightning is the only thing lighting the scene. Yeah. He's stranded. How do you even react to that, man? Like, I mean, obviously you try to stay as calm as you can, but yeah. your first instinct is to reach someone that can help you. Yeah. Worst part of it is they were 200 miles off course. So he has no idea. He has a maybe an estimate, right? Well, they were trying to reach um, Tahiti, right? Mm-hmm. Man, he's fucking amazing. Yeah. At this point, it's like, it's like, is it a blessing or a curse that you survived the crash? Because... And I got a whole other set of problems to deal with. Probably still a blessing though. Like I'd rather yeah. deal with problems than go that way. You know, plane yeah. crash is probably my worst nightmare. Oh, dude. <laughs> I'd yeah. rather anything else but that. I'm loving <laughs> <laughs> the, f the package made it. Ain't that the joke. I love how they're taking their time to let us settle in as much as the character is. Yeah. I, I really love films that let us feel like the character in that yes. moment. Yes. Doesn't sound like it, man. Yeah. Smart. Need to start a fire, man. Some smoke, somehow, yeah. at least. Something. <laughs> That's smart. I love how this movie is doing like beat by beat everything I would do. So it's a, it's yeah. in that sense, it's smart writing. It's really taking into account how a real person would react to this situation. Right. You know, he's right. not like immediately coming up with the perfect solution, but you do yeah. improve on the solutions that you do come up with. Yeah. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's terrifying. Could be anything. He's still collecting packages. I mean, you never know what's in them, man. I'm going to assume be... it's for survival purposes, right? And not yeah. like a man that's so obsessed with his job. <laughs> he doesn't care if he's I'll lost sure on the island. <laughs> making it back home, baby. I don't think he gives a shit at this point. <laughs> it's like, fuck your packages. Now, how are you going to open it up? That's the fun part. <laughs> Anybody ever try to open up a coconut like that? He needs to find a sharp edge, you know? There you go. Oh, there you go. Nice. That's actually very, very... Perfect instrument right there to open one of those. Nice. Hell yeah. All right, that's progress. Come on. Nice. Yeah, this majority of the water is just gone. It's going to have to get better at it. Yeah. Little by little. Ah, there you Smart go. Smart guy. There you, you go. Perfect yeah. your strategies. It, exactly. Oh. Yes. That's very, very helpful in this situation. Is that a cave? It looks like one. And it's natural shelter. Yeah, just gotta make sure that nothing is living inside there and then you're yes. you're good to go. <laughs> wow. It's all blue. It's gonna be all water, isn't it? The speck in the in the middle of the ocean. Man. Oh my god, it's a freaking dot, huh? Yeah. There's nothing. That's it. It's way smaller than I thought it would yeah, be. Yeah, I thought it was going to be bigger too. What's that? I don't know. Oh, is that one of the pilots? Oh, boy. Man, even crabs are munching on him already. Jesus. Keep the crab, it's food. You have a point. I really hope you have the same size. Oh, uh, well, it's better than nothing, right? Yeah. You can still sort of wear them. They're just going to be yeah. extremely uncomfortable. 
Oh, flash. Oh, oh nice. It works. Nice, nice, okay. nice. Oh, man. <sighs> yeah, it's nice of him. Give him wow. a proper burial. Oh, man. Wow. Shit, he was young too. 45, man. It's almost ironic how this guy was in such a rush for everything. Life <laughs> gave him a break. <laughs> it's like, you're going to be here for a while. That's funny. Gotta let the toesies breathe. There's a light all the way <gasps> at the end of the oh coast, my God. dude. He missed it. That's, uh, oh, no. there's land. Please look. I don't look. think that's land. I think that's a boat. In the night. S -O -S, please. Oh my god, man. He's not doing what I think he's gonna do. He's gonna swim all the way there? No, man. Uh, Those waves are too strong for that thing. Yeah. The amount of energy you need to roll all the way there, yeah, too. Yeah, I know. It's uh. relentless. Yeah. It's so unforgiving. It sucks. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oof. Oh. oh. There goes his raft. <sighs> Those waves are strong. Ah. Oh. Ah, dude. Oof. How deep is the cut? <sighs> The only good thing is that technically it's sterilized already, right? Because of all the salt in the water. Yeah. At, as much as it can be, as, at yeah. least. Yeah, the cave. Nice. Stay there, stay dry, and rest. Kind of looks muddy, no? I mean, yeah, but at this point... Yeah, that's true. I don't think he's really looking at it from the hygienic standpoint. <laughs> oh, the flashlight. It's gonna run out of battery. Such bad luck, man. All he was trying to do was to sort of make a situation better, and it just got so much worse. Fuck. <laughs> no flashlight now. He has to figure out how to make a fire. Yeah, that's the, honestly the the one thing he has to start doing. Because that way he can sterilize the rainwater as well, you know, boil it. Mm, true. Because rainwater is also not necessarily super clean. Because I'm thinking like, not like hygienic, but like dysentery or other things that can make you really sick and make things worse. Yeah, man, stop hogging them and just open it up already. Something in there might save your life. Not those. Imagine. <laughs> I mean, aren't the things super flammable? Oh, maybe you're you're onto use something that, here. Use that for fire. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Boy can entertain himself now. Oh. Ooh. Ha ha. You thinking what I'm thinking? For the coconuts. Amongst other things, those are sharp. Oh. Very nice. Wow. It's gonna come in real Very handy, nice. man. Hell yeah. Ooh. Oh, look at oh, him. Oh, that's so smart. Nice. Wow. Oh. Yeah. Oof. The amount of work. Oh my <sighs> god. Imagine. That's why it's so handy having those stones that they sell where you can just rub it against the other stone yeah. and just create sparks because it's such a useful thing to have. Oh, his tooth. You've got to be kidding. Nice. There you go. That's a bit drier. That's the strands from there the coconut, go. right? Yeah. Come on. Man. Oh. <sighs> Yeah, man, like, fuck. Nature is hurting him all around. <laughs> he drew a little face. <laughs> Just a friendly face, you know? <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, at least it gives you the illusion of not being that lonely, right? Because right. that's the terrifying thing, man. Well, little by little, right? Yeah. He's getting better at it. 
progress is progress, right? It's yeah. Just one step closer to making an actual fire. Man, that first fire is going to feel like yeah. such an event. Ooh. Smoke. Okay. <gasps> Let's go. Oh my god. Yes. Hell yes, man. Hey, <laughs> let's go. That's the true joy. He spent how, yes. how many days trying to get a fire? Dude. Trying to light a fire. Now he has it. I have made fire. I have made fire. <laughs> that is, I mean, come on. There you go. There you go. He's cooking. Yeah, that's going to taste so much better now. Yeah. Ah, there you go. Nice. See, at a restaurant, you wouldn't have to pay a shit ton of money for that. <laughs> True. Fresh. Here, get it for free. <laughs> yeah. And flew around that storm for about an hour. So yeah. A distance of, what, 400 miles? 502,004. That's a search area of 500,000. Oh. Oh, my God. My God. It's twice the size of Texas. Twice the Jesus size of Texas Christ. to look for one man. And it's a speck of an island, too. It's not like it's going to be in any map, you know? Yeah, exactly. It's too tiny. Oh, no. What is happening? <sighs> oh, you got to be kidding me. Is he? I think he's going to. Is he going to mm. take care of that tooth problem himself? Oh, my God. Ah, uh, that is horrible. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God, my heart just sank. The pain, I can feel it. Oh, like I said, it feels also so real because very recently <laughs> I've experienced like severe tooth pain. She knows and we like we took care of it. I'm fine now. But man, that shit is no joke. Man. Oh, my God. I'm sweating. Four years later. Four years later. Oh, shit. Damn. Oh. Whoa. He's even fishing like that. Just yeah, he's, he's gotten better at it. Damn, dude. Four years. What is that? Imagine this person lost type of shit. <laughs> it's missing the flares. No lens flare. No. That's true. No, no vibes. lens flares. Yeah. No smoke. <laughs> oh, it's part of the fuselage. Four years later, it's still coming in. Can you imagine? Like I can't, honestly. Like, how do you stay sane? That's the thing, right? Like, no connecting with anybody else. The food yeah. is scarce. The water is scarce. He never chose to give up at any point. I do like that about his character. He's very persistent and resourceful. Really resourceful. Oh. So he's going to try again. Look at him making multiple fires, man. I love that. What a boss. What an he, absolute yeah, legend. He, seriously, he is a boss. Gonna build a little raft of his own. 44 lashing, so we have to make rope again. Okay. How do you even make rope? <laughs> ah. Oh. Man, watching these kind of movies makes me realize how screwed I would be if this would have, <laughs> would have happened to me. Like, I'm knowledgeable, but I think I have a very normal baseline. We have to build it. We have to stock it. We have to mm -hmm. launch it. And it's not much time. No. We live and we die by time, don't we? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I do believe that everybody at once in their life should go take a course for like survivalist oh, uh, 100%. knowledge, you know, yeah. I, I do think it could be worth ah. trying. Yeah. You were right about the tape. You were right about the tape. <laughs> no, we have time. We do. We have time. Look, the wind's still blowing in from the west. Come on, Wilson. Yeah, I know. I know where there's 30 feet of extra rope, but I'm not going back up there. He's fantastic. 
He's fantastic. Oh, did that snap? Oh. Wait. Oh, there's actually a lot of rope there you yeah. can use. Damn, so he tried to see if it would work, hang himself, and that snapped the branch off, and then he realized it wouldn't work because it wouldn't carry his weight. You were right. It was a good thing that we did a test because it wasn't going to be just a quick little snap. It would have landed on the rocks. And yeah. Yeah. My leg or my back or my neck. We might just make it. Did that thought ever cross your brain? Exactly, Wilson. Don't be so sassy, man. Yeah, I know, Wilson. Be a little supportive. The ocean to stay here and die on the shithole island spending the rest of my life talking to a goddamn volleyball don't abuse wilson man come on it's it's insane that they go into the psychology because like yeah, yeah you're gonna have low days in this situation man you yes know? Wilson! Wilson! <laughs> well there he is okay oh he's right there yeah never again never again you're okay Wow. I mean, it's the, the only company he's had in years, man. The only thing keeping him sort of sane. What a Damn, legend. Damn, dude. Wilson, the volleyball. Look at that raft. That better hold. Oh, my God. After all those resources and all those hours building something, everything is so priceless <laughs> yeah. that it just cannot fail. Like, the amount of energy it takes is also... And he needs to leave at the right time so he can catch the current so he can end up where he needs to be, you know? Yeah. Yeah, what is that in that package? I don't know. Oh, yeah. The wind just changed direction. Oh my god. It's gonna have to leave soon. My heart is racing for him. I know, I man. really want him to... He better not die. I'll be so freaking mad. Uh, I, I'm, <laughs> it better not end that way because I'm gonna be so heartbroken. Wow. My heart breaks for him. Like even in, in every yeah. single part of his journey, like he's always been remembering her. Wow. Wow. <laughs> A moment of truth, Damn, man. Damn, dude. Let's do this. I'll do all the paddling. <laughs> you just hang on. Wow, man. It's incredible. So impressive. Yeah. He built that, you know? Oof. Okay. Well, it's flexible, right? Please work. We're doing good so far. Oh, that's a big one. Oh, God. Not yet! Not yet! Oh, my God. Hold on! Hold on, Wilson! Ooh. <sighs> oh! No way! Oh. What a legend! He made a sale. <laughs> I think we did it. <laughs> I think we did it. <laughs> that is so impressive. Holy what the hell? I thought shit. that was like a shield for, like, to shield him from the outside. I mean, it works both ways, right? <laughs> of course, dude. He's a sailor. Right. That came in handy, huh? Ugh, oh, man. Mm -hmm. Oh, my heart. I know. Uh, well, you're safe, man. Yeah. You're safe. That's what matters. Oh, it's a whale. <gasps> oh, my God. Wow. Such majestic creatures, huh? I know. <sighs> Dude. Swimming with whales. It's crazy how we really are just at the mercy of nature. Oh my goodness. What? I was actually thinking about that just before the whale showed up. I'm like, how is he going to eat? He needs food, but. Yeah. Oh, oh no. For the love of God, pull it back. No. <gasps> 
Oh no! Now he's just lost at the mercy of the sea again. Oh my god. He lost so much of the raft. Is that Wilson? Oh no. Oof. Good morning. Whale? Oh no! Oh, he's behind him. He's in the background. He's behind yeah. him. Where's Wilson? Wilson, where are you? Wilson! Oh man, don't swim too far. Oh. Wilson! I'm coming. The amount of energy this man is like, yeah, using up right now. Wilson! No. Oh, no. Wilson! 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 Oh, that's so sad. I know. Like... I'm sorry! I'm sorry, Wilson! Wilson, I'm sorry! Oh, man. <laughs> On paper, it kind of sounds weird, right? To get emotional over a yes. volleyball, but it's just, you know how much it means to him, you know? Yeah. It's like the only thing he has, and then yeah. just like losing the only thing that ha he has, it's... Yeah. It's that's like what makes it hurt so much. One of the things that kept him going, you know? <laughs> that's so sad. Fuck no. <laughs> Ugh. The whale. Yeah. <laughs> it's like an alarm clock. I was just gonna it's say, to it's like up. such a way to wake up, huh? <gasps> no way! No fucking oh, way! Oh, it's a boat! A oh, ship? That's no, a that's a ship. Yeah, that's a ship. Oh man, please wake Dude, up. Dude, wake up! Even the, <laughs> the whale, whale is helping. It's like, it's like bro. <laughs> it's like, bro. <laughs> you got your ship right here, man. How do you even signal it, man? I don't, I don't think there's know, like man. people constantly checking what's outside, right? Oh my God. And it's so loud. How would they even hear you? Please wake up. Holy crap. That's a massive ship. <laughs> Please, someone be out there. Oh, he's there, right oh, there. Yeah, yeah. I think that's the alarm. Probably because they saw him. Hello? Okay. I mean, it's been years, man. What is she even doing right now? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. This is gonna be so heartbreaking, man. <laughs> Shit. I mean. Fuck. What do you say? People move on. Four mm. years. Probably thought he was dead. One Dr. Pepper, two cups of ice. He's alive. He's well. Damn, dude. Yeah. What a what a journey. Plane pulls in, we get off, and there's a little ceremony right there in the hangar. Then we'll take you over to see Kelly. Damn, She's dude. She's actually going to be there. I mean, if you're sure you want to do that. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <sighs> what in the world am I going to say to her? What the hell is she going to say to you, man? What like, the hell is she going to say to you? Chuck, Kelly had to let you go. You got to prep him, yeah. yeah. She thought you were dead. And we buried you. We had a funeral and a coffin and a gravestone. A Damn, dude. Wow. We had a coffin. <laughs> For what? <laughs> what was in it? <laughs> <laughs> well, everybody put something in. That's sweet, though. Cell phone, beeper, uh, <laughs> some pictures. I put in some Elvis CDs. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Anything, right? That reminded them of him. And then you had Mary's funeral. You know. Jeez, she died. <laughs> and it wasn't. It wasn't even your Bro, fault, man. It's don't not your don't fault. put that on you. Four years ago, the FedEx family lost five of our sons. 
But today, one of those sons, Chuck Nolan, has been returned to us. So surreal. Wow, man. So Imagine. lucky to be on land, man, and have shoes and <sighs> food and drinks available. Like, yeah, it really be back in oh, abundance, right? Man, it gets me emotional just thinking about it. <laughs> he looks like he's so out of place. Uh. You probably don't remember me. I, I actually did root canal on you about five years ago. Oh. You have got to be kidding. That's just funny. I'm Kelly's husband. Oh my god. Kelly wanted to be here. Uh, oh, look, this is very hard I, for everyone. She didn't show? I can't even imagine how hard it is for you. Why didn't she show, at least? It's, it's confusing. It's, it's very emotional for her. She's, she's sort of lost. <sighs> Sorry. That... This is so awkward and so... At least just... the husband seems to be understanding of Kelly's situation, though. Yeah, I mean, you know? it's just the situation doesn't get any easier. At no. least they're, like, mature enough to talk about it. Yeah. She's a wreck. I mean, how the... F like, how the hell do you even cope with that? Because there's so many human emotions that go into yeah. that. Like, she probably feels guilty as fuck for letting yeah. go of him, even though it's the right thing to do when, like, just to keep yeah. your sanity, right? You can't be, like, I mean, you're expecting gonna, every day yeah. for someone that's gone to show up. Yeah. Aww. Aww. You know, Chuck, we got to catch up on some of that fishing now. <laughs> oh, he's going like, to <laughs> beat all of you in so many different styles oh of fishing, God, man. Yeah. Facts. <laughs> oh. It must feel so weird. Well, if you need anything, just sign for it and uh, see you in the morning. Get some sleep, okay? We got another big day tomorrow. It takes a lot of paperwork to bring back a man. I was just going to say, because that's... You know, I never thought of that. <sighs> when you're declared yeah, legally gone, dead. like dead. <laughs> all of this is meaningless without her. It's like he's alive, but... Look at all of that food. <sighs> I love how this movie puts into perspective all the, Damn, the things all that we. Damn, y'all are messed up for putting. <laughs> all Can you imagine? Things. He tries. He's like, nah, I used to make him better. <laughs> what a joke, man. That's just. Also, can we talk about the fact that Kelly married a fucking dentist? I'm sure he's a nice guy. <laughs> no, he seems. And look how easy it is to make fire. I just love yeah. the visual representation that they're yeah. doing here as to, as to how easy a lot of us have it, right? Like we yeah. have a roof, you know, we have electricity, fire yeah. at, at will, you know. Damn, he's sleeping on the floor, yeah. Food. The bed, yeah, the bed is too soft, I bet. How long are you going to be, man? Is that her home? How long will that by me? About 10 minutes. Oh, man. I'm awake. <laughs> I saw your taxi drive up. Oh my god. Oh my god. I saw you down at the hub today, so I know you were down there. <sighs> How is she even going to tell him that she has a kid? I don't think she has to say anything. It's all the kids' stuff. It's so not fair for him. No. So let me get one thing straight here. We have a pro football team now, but they're in Nashville. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. Thank God. I thought he was going to say something terrible to her. Um, well, yeah, yes. I think her oh too. God. They used to be in Houston. First they were the Oilers. <laughs> they were the Titans. They went to the Super Bowl last year. And I missed that. Oh, you would have died. It was so Oh. Uh, Bevan, are you uh, becoming a professor? You're not Dr. Kelly Frears? Love it. When your plane went down, everything just sort of got put on hold. I mean... Sure, it's a hard thing to process while you're trying to get your doctorate. Oh my god. I want you to have it. I gave it to you. That's a family heirloom and it should stay in your family. Oh. <sighs> so here's where that ship found you. You drifted about 500 miles. 500 miles? Ships went back and forth for weeks looking for you. I never should have gotten on that plane. <sighs> I never should have gotten out of the car. I want to show you something. It really hits hard, man. Man. With that line, just one plane, one, one choice. Small decision like that, yeah. You kept our car. <laughs> All right, now, this is weird. I <laughs> <laughs> had a lot of memories of this car. Two very nice memories. Hey. 
Oh. Can <laughs> <laughs> you get some stuff out of the back? This what? is so hard to watch. <sighs> what hurts the most? You see you, the you love see is the sparks. still there. You see the yeah. sparks, man. But at this point, it's just not the right thing to do. You know? Fuck it. Divorce this guy. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Me too. Man, that just hurts. Yeah. Jack! 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 <laughs> <laughs> I love you. You're the love of my life. I love you too, Kelly. More than you'll ever know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> More than you will ever know. Oh, man. So what now? I mean, just get a divorce then and you can't live like this. No. I really like that they're taking their time with the aftermath too. You know, it's not yeah. just he escaped so now everything is perfect. No, it's, it's... He has to adapt all over again. Coming you know? back to life is still half of the fight. You yeah. Know? It's an impossible decision, man. Yeah, it's but it's the right decision for the kid. That's the problem. And the husband, too. Like, he's just been a good guy, you know? He's just been taking care yeah, of his family. Of he fell in love. Like, he has nothing to do with this. I'm back hmm. in Memphis talking to you. It's so <laughs> surreal. It must be so, so surreal to him. Yeah, so bizarre. <laughs> and I've lost her all over again. <sighs> I'm so sad that I don't have Kelly. But I'm so grateful that she was with me on that island. <sighs> oh, my heart. I know. You gotta keep breathing. Because tomorrow the sun will rise. Who knows what the tide could bring? Who knows what the tide could yeah. bring? Yeah. <laughs> He's chugging that water. I'd be doing the same. <laughs> Man. Is there like one movie where Tom Hanks gets the girl or no? Like, oh my god! Jesus. I'm like, what? It's funny because it keeps having that symbol of the wings. That's like kind of what brought him here. The sail also had the symbol. Yeah. Oh, Bettina. Yeah. It's the woman that shipped that first package to Russia. Mm -hmm. This package saved my life. Wow. I love the symbolism of the crossroads yeah. and we started at the crossroads and now he's at a crossroads the, all over again. Just the visual language of the movie, you know, like yeah. the abundance when he's yeah. back home, you know, and the lack yeah. of things yeah. obviously at the island. And now look, just seeing him even drink water has yeah. like such a deeper meaning. You oh. lost. I do. Where are you headed? Well, I was just about to figure that out. <laughs> and if you head back that direction. Find a whole lot of nothing all the way to Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck, cowboy. Yeah, I thought it's the girl from the beginning. <laughs> yeah, you should, you know what? Get yourself a dog, actually. Yeah, that's her. Man, I'm happy for his survival, but I feel so bad for him. Like, he's, he's still yeah. lost. Well, now it's the choice paralysis, right? We have so many options now. Oh, my heart, man. Don't do this to me. I know. These movies, Jesus, they really Fuck. have like, a, <laughs> you know, this one was emotional, I think, at a different level. You know, not, not quite like Green Mile or Forrest Gump emotional like that. Yeah. This is more of a movie I feel like to sort of reflect, right? Yeah. This this movie, in a way, I'm very pensive now. You know, it kind yeah. of makes you realize all the things that we take for granted. This is a very reflective movie. 
you know, and it's kind of funny because he was so just almost consumed by his work. I don't think it's necessarily like, you know, fuck the job, only focus on your loved ones. Like, no, like it's about a balance. But I think it is also important, like, to remember that we should cherish the people that we love and the time that we get together. Really, really, really good movie, man. Yeah. That's going to stay with me for a while. <laughs> yeah. This one is going to stay with us, guys. Yeah. Thank you for joining us. Uh, I'm sure that a few of you had your tissues ready. A few of you shed yeah. some tears. You know, message still stands. You know, hold your loved ones, enjoy the moment, enjoy the the abundance while we have it, you know, and uh, yeah. yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching with us and we Thank hope you. that you guys enjoyed and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care. See ya.